IS 7200 Legal and Ethical Issues in IS Overview. Let's review the course and the syllabus for IS 7200 Legal and Ethical Issues in IS. As you're listening to this video, I encourage you to open the course syllabus and follow along. The learning outcomes for the course Overview include review the course description, list the textbooks required, outline the course objective, identify the learning outcomes, explore the alignment of course learning outcomes with graded activities, and review assignments and weightings. This course is a survey of contemporary legal and ethical issues faced by IS professionals. Topics include a review of applicable statutes and regulations that impact the IS organization. Students will conduct online research and explore ethical issues at the leading edge of the organization's technology frontiers. The required textbook is Ethics in Information Technology, 6th edition by George Reynolds. The course objective is legal issues such as intellectual property, privacy, and product liability permeate the contemporary IS organization. In many instances, the velocity of change of the technologies is outpacing society's ability to formulate policy in the form of statutes and regulations. This rate of change requires organizations to develop and provide both legal and ethical training to guide employees in making decisions to deal with circumstances in which there may be no law, regulation, company policy, or precedent. This course will expose the IS professional to the basic legal and ethical issues in technology management. As a result of completing this course, students will be able to identify major trends in intellectual property law and policy as it relates to IT, prepare research on contemporary ethical and or legal issues in IT, investigate emerging ethical issues in IT, evaluate strategies for protecting data and technology assets, and develop plans to address legal and ethical issues in IT. The course learning outcomes are aligned with the graded activities as shown in the table and in the syllabus. Assignments and weightings are shown in the following chart. Rubrics and grading guidelines are listed in the course syllabus. There are five discussion board postings and responses. Each post is worth eight points and each response is worth two points for a total of 50 points. And there are two exams worth 25 points each for a total of 50 points. For more information on any of these topics, please refer to the course syllabus or post on the Q&A discussion board.